Girls every year in Wisconsin, new names are added to a missing persons list. Some of those names appear more than for more than 50 years now. April is Missing Persons Awareness Month, and our Brittany Schmidt tells us about an event this weekend to remember those who've vanished in Wisconsin. When driving down the highway, billboards are meant to grab your attention. This month, more than 200 people's names will flash across the screen because they are missing in Wisconsin. We fundraise all year to be able to provide this. Some dating back more than 50 years. These boards are seen by a lot of people providing a lot of hope to these families. Hope to families still waiting for answers about their loved one's disappearance. Marsha Loritz is among them. Her mother, Victoria Prokopovitz, has been missing since 2013. While there's a conviction in the case, her mother's body has never been found. You just have such empathy for them because you were there. You understand um, what they're going through and their desperation. And all you, all you can do is offer them some hope and support and some information that maybe we didn't have in that situation. Loritz didn't know where to turn or what resources were available to help. She turned her grief and experience into action. She created a nonprofit called Wisconsin Missing Persons Advocacy. Now all of those resources will be in one spot this weekend for the 10th annual Missing Persons Awareness Event. Just suggestions of what to do, what not to do. Um, it's, it's such a hard thing because you are so desperate for answers and so you don't know where to turn and you don't know um, what you should be doing. So the simple information of that, you know, search and rescue is, isn't something you should pay for, that it's, it's free and um, things like that, you know, and um, you end up in a situation where you're um, a target to be, um, you know, taken advantage of. The free event will also include a moment of silence for the missing, search and rescue dog demos, balloon twisting, and a silent auction. Awareness brings prevention, and so this is not just for people with missing persons. This is to have, um, you know, information um, for the community to receive. You know, you never know if you're going to find yourself in a situation where someone you know is needing these resources. And as I said, some of these resources are just, not just missing persons, but things that would keep your, your loved ones safe. The event is this Saturday at the Brown County Sheriff's Office from 1 to 4 p.m. In Brown County, Brittany Schmidt, Action 2 News.